more than enough to win. Okay. It's going to go for the Queen's Gambit again. I guess I'm principled in the sense that I believe that this these positions are fairly good for white, so there's no reason why I shouldn't go for them. So he could go, yeah, exactly. So he's gone. Uh, he's gone for um, for uh, g6 voluntarily, but then at least I, I'm a tempo up here. I have the bishop on b1. Whether that helps me a lot, I don't know, but yeah, no. Now that he's gonna f5 without me committing to e5, I'm not so sure about that. I feel like he's giving me some dark squares. And both his knights are competing for the same square on e6. a6, yeah, he was probably worried about knight b5 there, the previous move. Whether it was with good reason or not, I don't know. But I feel like no, there's no reason not to just play very positionally here. Seeing as static factors factors of the positions are of the position are good for me. Um, better bishop and somewhat more. Um, and he has a weakness on d5, which I'm attacking with a lot of pieces now probably more pieces than he can defend that very pawn with so I think it's uh, it's going very well but it's all very very standard stuff mm -hmm. yeah the pawn is hanging no reason to take not to take it d5 rook c3 I can either take on e6 or or b7. Felt like somehow keeping the knights there rather than the bishop was the more dynamic choice on, on my part, so that's why I went for that. Yeah, let me just take it d5. Okay, you can go queen d6, maybe that wasn't so clever. Also, this one. Yeah, that was just stupid. Oh well. Still better, obviously. Trying to gain control over the long diagonal. Probably has to go queen c5, yeah, queen e3. Makes sense as well. Knight, e, knight b6 is an option. Probably just go b4. c1 is also a threat. Now I can go, go for this. Should be easily winning. Yeah, but now. Oh. Maybe the pawn ending isn't. Takes, takes. King g1, king d5. Yeah, I cannot go for the pawn ending. Or I'm not gonna go for, for the pawn ending. Let's put it like that. So I shall probably rely on the ever so dull method of flagging him instead. I don't like this at all. My pawn is on f4 is so bad. Pushing the pawns a bit, at least, finally. Oh, this has been unimpressive, to say the least. I'll just 
just gonna try and flag him. Yeah, there's no mate, sorry. King h4, a8 prevents the mate. 